Hi everyone, it's Phil from Ash and Leather. I have so much incredible stuff today to show you, including this one of a kind Color 8 Marble Chill Cordovan Long Wallet. Before we get to this one, let's take a preview of some of the stuff that's shipping out today. I have an intense blue Shell Cordovan Fat Herbie, color number four Shell Cordovan Fat Herbie, black Dublin Fat Herbie, color eight marbled Shell Cordovan Frank the Enforcer, a raw Shell Cordovan Frank the Enforcer, a black reverse Shell Cordovan Frank the Enforcer, a black reverse one shot card holder, black Shell Cordovan Valet Tray, color eight Chrome Excel Valet Tray, a Garnet Shell Cordovan Apple Watch Band, Intense Blue Shell Cordovan Apple Watch Band, a Carbon Fiber Chicago Comb with an English Tan Dublin Sheath, a Tumble Natural Shell Cordovan Giant of the Fox, Color Number 8 Chrome Excel Giant of the Fox, Natural Chrome Excel Bugs Moran, Cobalt Blue Dublin Bugs Moran, and a Color Number 8 Shell Cordovan Bugs Moran. And at the end of the video here, I have a Special surprise that I'll, I'll save for the end, but check out this incredible long wallet and I was hesitant hesitant to even show this Because this is something that I just can't really offer and the reason that we can't offer this and that it actually took this customer uh, quite a bit of time to get this and uh, They've been very supportive of us. So we tried to get them something special and the reason we can't do this one is because of the color eight on the inside we have to pick naturally thin pieces for the color eight marbled here. And we simply don't get enough of the marble shell cordovan to be able to pick those naturally thin pieces of shell that we, re we require for this wallet. So the, so the only colors that we do offer for the interiors of John the Fox and this long wallet are the color number eight shell cordovan and the black shell cordovan. That's because we get a good amount of those colors of shells as opposed to the rare colors like the color eight marbled or the blue or natural and anything like that. Roughly 2% of the shells are appropriately thin for a wallet like this. So it's just not something that I can offer. So I ha figured I had to document this one to show you this incredible piece. And the other thing I wanted to note on this is there's something magical about the marble shells in particular where we get this really large context that shows off all that random character. It's a little harder to translate that on something like a, like a Frank the Enforcer because you don't get this huge context of shell. So I love this color eight marbled long wall. This is going out to a special customer. Now I have two fat Herbies that are back in stock. Check out this intense blue shell cordovan. And of course this is intense blue shell cordovan fat Herbie. These are now back in stock. Put up some new photos on the website if you wanna check these out. Here's another Fat Herbie that is currently back in stock. This is a color number four Shell Cordovan Fat Herbie. And this for many years was my favorite shell color and until recently the Amaretto has sort of overtaken that as the number one spot. But man, I love this medium brown reddish undertones of the color four. And here's another Fat Herbie that is shipping out today. And check out this Black Dublin. For me, Black Dublin is by far the best black leather that you can get. And if you take a look closely here, you can see the reason why I say that is because it has so much natural character to it. It still looks like leather, where most black leathers you find in the world look more like finish. They look more like paint. They're so heavily finished, you cover up all that natural character. And I just love the Dublin for that reason, but also it's a vegetable tan leather, so this does mold around its contents very nicely. In fact, the Dublin, including this black Dublin, all the Dublin colors are tanned using the same tree barks that are used to tan the Shell Cordovan. So here's another color number eight marbled piece, the same leather that we used on that long wallet, but you get to see a little bit less context here, although we do try to make it interesting and include more variation. So in the middle card slot there, you can see a little bit more of the marbling effect going on. And on the back, we try to include some more cool stuff Frank the Enforcer is the minimalist style that I suggest to people that want a front pocket wallet. So here's the last one of our limited run Raw Shell Cordovan Frank the Enforcer. And I love the Raw Shell Cordovan for the way that it accumulates and develops patina. So you can see here, it starts off quite light. This is the lightest you will ever see a piece of Shell Cordovan. 
It's even a little bit lighter than the regular natural shells, and it's a little bit less orange. Something happens when we finish the shells and polish them. They turn slightly more vibrant and orange. I think that's just because of the polish that's applied to the surface. But the effect that happens here is the color begins to develop a little bit darker and a little bit more golden in color, but also the luster changes. So right now you can see it has a subtle sheen and I'm noticing my lights here are just blasting it. It's almost like a dull matte finish in person here. But when you wear this, it develops a really nice layer of luster on the surface of the leather. It's almost like a layer of glass on the top. It gives it a really nice bright face to it. Here's another Frank the Enforcer. This one is in black reverse shell cordovan. And we, uh, we like the black reverse because this green color is really cool. But obviously it is not black at all. And the reason it's called black reverse is because the inside of this one is black shell cordovan. When you flip the black shell inside out and sort of look at the unintended side, it's more of this greenish shade. And the reason that happens is in the finishing process for the shell cordovan, when they apply the black stain to the shell side of the leather, they actually dip it into a barrel of water after. And that barrel of water starts to accumulate those dyes. And it's sort of a green black dye that they use. So the water starts to look about this color. And the longer the run goes, the darker that barrel of water becomes. So we start to see more dark shades like on the bottom here. And towards the beginning of the run, it's a little bit more tan like on the top. All right, here's another black reverse piece. This is on one of our new items, the one-shot card holder. I wanted something very simple to offer people at sort of a reasonable price because a lot of these shell cordovan items are super expensive and I under understand, I get it. Um, it's something that I want everybody to experience. So I try, I'm trying my best to make this product a little bit less expensive so you can get your hands on some shell cordovan. I think the leather is so special and it can only be appreciated by using it. So here's a black reverse shell one shot going out. If you want a one shot out of any leather, just let me know and I'll make it for you. Now here's a better demo of what I was talking about with the black shell cordovan. So this is our valet tray in black shell cordovan. You can see this is the normal side of the shell that we tend to cut for most everything. But on the unintended side, it's that green shade. And not only do we get to see the random die marks and the random character and color range in the reverse that I think is really interesting, we also get an opportunity to show off this really cool Horween ink stamp that a lot of people are interested in. Uh, so the, the reverse shell cord of it and the valet trays are a great way to get a look at uh, some of that greenish tone and more of that Horween ink stamp. All right, here's another valet tray. This one is in the color number eight Chrome Excel, and we offer these in two shell cordovan colors, the black and color eight, but we also do three Chrome Excel colors, including this color number eight Chrome Excel. And on the Chrome Excel that we use for the valet trays, we put in a little bit of extra effort. Similarly to how we do on our new belts, we're actually finishing in the unintended side of this chrome excel. So we put a stain coat of color eight to match the color eight on the outside, and then we finish it in with a resin coat. So on the belts, we're, we're not really adding that stain because I, I think it rubs off a little bit onto your pants eventually, but on a valet tray, that's not a big deal. I think it just improves the look. I have a couple Apple watch bands to show you. Here's a really nice one in garnet shell cordovan. And I'm looking for some feedback because I actually, check this out, I shattered that hell out of my Apple watch. Um, so I'm looking to, <laughs> I bought another one that's on the way, but I'm looking to try a new strap. If you guys have any thoughts on which one you'd like to see me wear, I can document that. But check out this garnet shell. The garnet shell cordovan is the most red shell color that you will find. And some angles, like this angle here, it's almost more like a color number eight. So it has a really dynamic color range. And you can see the lightest range right there. Here's another Apple Watch band in the Intense Blue Shell Cordovan. I'm a big fan of the Intense Blue. This one has a, another bit of color range to it. We see this one range from more of like an aqua blue in the undertones. I hope it translates well in this video. It's almost like a greenish blue. And on the surface of this leather, and the dark range, is more of like a dark navy. So in certain lights and certain angles, it almost reads as a black. But the combination of those two colors in here, I think makes for a really great depth of color on the intense blue shell. 
And we have a comb from Chicago Comb going out today. This is a carbon fiber comb that they make right here in Chicago. These carbon fiber combs are very nice. They're rather inexpensive and the rigidity and strength of this carbon fiber is incredible. Uh, so if you want a comb that's gonna last you forever, I highly suggest that. And we sell them with the English Tan Dublin leather sheets. Here's another limited release item that we're doing. This is our Johnny the Fox in the tumbled natural shell cordovan. And this one really reminds me of the raw shell. So here's the raw shell Frank from earlier. You can see the color is roughly the same and they're both sort of like this matte dull finish, which is cool. And I think the coolest part is, is the more that you wear it, the darker it gets and it develops that layer of luster I talked about before. The big difference on the tumbled natural, and I don't know if you can see it here, um, it's softer and that's because it's been tumbled. So it doesn't have as much stand as the normal shells where it's like very dense and firm and rigid. The tumbled natural, it has like a little bit more roundness to it. It's a little drapier. It's, I mean, it's not like a rag, but it's much softer than the regular shells. And on top of that, we get this really interesting pebble pattern happening on the outside. On this Johnny the Fox, we have a color number eight shell cordovan interior, which I mentioned before, it's hard for us to make any shell cordovan interiors. So the most often, or the, the most common ones that you'll see are the color eight like this, or black shell cordovan. We also do the reverse color eight and black reverse on our Johnny the Fox. Here's another Johnny the Fox. And speaking of color eight, this is a color eight Chrome Excel Johnny the Fox. And you might notice the color eight Chrome Excel is very similar to the color eight shell. I observe this to be slightly more red and slightly more cherry than the color eight shell. Both of them are very nice. There's an obvious price difference. Uh, but we tried to get the essence of the Color 8 Shell Cordovan into this Chrome Excel piece. This is another new offering for us. We had not offered the Johnny the Fox in Color 8 Chrome Excel for a very long time. And we now have it available with this custom black horsehide interior. And I have a few Bugs Morans to show you today. This one first. This is a natural Chrome Excel. And I love the form factor of our Bugs Moran. This is a great option for a minimalist front pocket kind of guy. Uh, and the reason I like it for that is the form factor, like I mentioned, it's quite small, very compact, and it fits perfectly in your hand. But what's great about this design is these four card slots on the inside. The top two card slots will hold up to four, five, six cards. I don't like to use more than three or four in each slot. But the cool thing is the larger two slots on the bottom here, those will, all fo those will both fit US dollars folded in half. So you can carry some cash and some cards in this one. Now here's another Bugs Moran, and check out this beautiful cobalt blue Dublin shade. This one really reminds me of the intense blue shell cordovan for the color, where we get that depth of color and a little bit of a color range, where you can see on the spine here where I flexed it, it's a little bit more of an aqua blue shade, where the other sections of the leather and the surface of this wallet are a little bit more navy. So the combination of those two colors, I think is just very fascinating, and the Oh, man, the undertone of this, I'm going to pull this one out for you. Check that out. The blue shade underneath here is just amazing. The last Bugs Moran to show you before we get to our special secret item. Check out this color eight marbled. That is awesome. This is how we've been seeing the color eight marbled shells come out of the tannery recently, where it's this little bit more of a subtle contrast. We have some of those orangey tones, a little bit of yellow, ranging more towards a brown, reddish brown, that classic color eight, and everything in between. But the contrast here is, is subtle. I like the ones that are very dramatic, but I think most people like this look. Check out the inside too. This is really unique. We don't often see the color eight marbled. We don't often see the reverse side being this green shade. So this is a unique Bugs Moran here with some incredible color uh, wow, this is one of my favorite shells, especially on the back here. All right, are you ready for this? Here's the other secret wallet. So at the beginning, I showed you a remarkable Color 8 marble shell long wallet. And this is an, another long wallet, but this is the black marbled. And man, that is a cool shell. 
again, when you get to see this huge context of the shell, it's just really, really magical. I like these horizontal lines here, looking at it at that angle. I think that is really cool. Check out the inside again. This marbling is really neat. This is another one of a kind wallet that I don't think I could ever do again. I mean, we're talking about years of accumulated pieces of shell to get just this one wallet because all the pieces on the inside here are thin pieces, all these little card slots, and they're super tough to get. So I'm very hesitant to show this, but I thought it was too cool to not show you. So I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you enjoy your holiday weekend if you have one here. Uh, we're selling, celebrating our independence this weekend. Hopefully you guys celebrate safely. Hope you enjoyed the uh, wallets today. If you have any questions, let me know. Until next week, I hope you have a great weekend.